Shelby County Sheriff's Office made quick work to rescue an elderly woman after her house caught fire in the middle of the night. Action News 5's Garner Montgomery is live in studio for us. So Garner, how is she doing tonight? So I talked to this woman's husband outside the home today and they are doing fine. She checked out of the hospital early this morning with no signs of smoke inhalation damaging her lungs thanks to the brave actions of first responders. May's household in Millington had a major scare in the middle of the night while their grandson was in the kitchen cooking. He went to the bathroom and when he came out I just heard a scream. By the time I got in the kitchen I could I could see the flame and you know, smoke that stopped filling the house then. And I told him you'll call 911. Edgar says he was concerned for his wife who couldn't get out of the house on her own. She can't walk as well. She do need the aid of a walker to get around, but it's kind of hard for her to you know, navigate the, the steps that we have in the house. By the time first responders arrived, she was still trapped inside. So the responding Shelby County deputies had to act fast. The sheriff's department jumped right on the scene, went in with no protection and you know, brought on out of the house, which I'm grateful for. By the time we got her out of the house, the uh, EMTs had arrived and they took over from there. Edgar says seeing deputies carrying his wife out safely was a huge relief. Man, I, you know, I'm, I was just really glad to see that. Shelby County Fire was able to extinguish those flames before it could spread outside of the kitchen. The three deputies were taken to the hospital for possible smoke inhalation as well, but they have all been released. Live in studio, Gordon Montgomery, Action News 5.